Hello everybody, this is TA Gaming 2154 here, and today is my first tutorial video. I'm going to show you guys how to encode an image into a sound file. So first, we're going to start up Ultima Sound 2. Now this is a uh, spectrograph program, so I'll set it to uh, integrated microphone array. It's the mic I'm using. So it'll show you the sound that's coming through, and it'll graph it like this. I prefer to have 3D often inverted right to left so then it'll go like that so if I whistle um, basically the frequency is on the y-axis and time is on the x-axis here so let's open up a uh, photo sounder now I haven't unzipped it yet and it's just the demo Photosounder demo.exe. So as, as we can see, this opens up. I just gotta get rid of that. So now we will stop that and set it to stereo mix, which is sound card. And we're going to open an image file. So we get back to uh Ultima Sound 2. We'll have this open. So we can see what's going on right here. Now we just need to um, set the frequency scale to uh, linear, because that's what this is the standard frequency scaling. And looks like that's already started. So then we're going to hit play that. Got this. Um, lower the that frequency. Let's lower that again. So now we'll see the face right there. We just need to slow down the pixels per second. We'll see it appear on the spectrograph. And that'll work for now. So we can see that it is an image in a sound file. We can actually save these sound files too, but I'm not going to do that. But the only problem with doing this trick is that the picture comes out to be a uh, grainy, really, really grainy, and it's a uh, grayscale. But um, my spectrograph isn't grayscale; it's like a blue, green, red type thing, kind of like a thermal imaging camera. So, I'm going to open up another um, image. Let's turn up my uh, volume a little bit. And try to That's the best it's going to get, so here we have it. See what else we can do. Do the why you know face. So there's that. Go ahead and play. So let's um, adjust.
can see it a little better. Let's see what if I turn it all the way back. Huh. Doesn't really seem to want to work. So. Standard pictures library. Classic troll face. Let's try this. I went through a little fast. That's better. So there we have the classic troll face. Let's open up another file. Alright, now I'm pretty sure we've all seen this image before. So. Went through a little slow. Let's speed it up. That'll work for now, but yeah, we can kind of see the image there. The spectrograph. Or spectrogram, whatever you prefer to call it. Alright. Let's see what else we can do. The periodic table of meat. Just how it looks here. Let's see if that helps any. Yeah, that definitely helps. So there we have it. Grab another image. So here's a picture I made with uh, Minimator. Um, there I am, photobombing in the background, just like every picture I make with uh, um, Minimator. So let's play this. Uh, speed it up and we'll see if it's better let that load up there there that looks better a lot better. Let's see if this helps anything. Doesn't look like it's going to help. Let's 
So we'll do one more uh, image file here. Let's go through the night. Pretty sure every uh, Minecraft player who um, screws around on YouTube has uh, heard this, that song before. So, play. that up a bit. All right, let's wait for that to load up. Just like it's working. And I just accidentally maximized that, so we'll do it one more time. So there we can see it. The only problem is that the image that comes from a photo sounder is, uh, really really grainy and it's uh, grayscale even though my uh, spectrograph is a uh, um, like a looks kinda like a thermal image but hey you still kinda get the image you you know what image it is so that's it for now I will see you guys later